Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Not Occupied a single Beat. clue pointing us toward Katomi's location, huh? A whole lot of people pass through Akiba every day. It isn't easy to pull one person out of the mess of faces. So, what's our next step? Do we look for more shady figures to ask, or wander the streets and search clues? Before I continue on, last episode I finally heard Lucy Christian's voice. I didn't even realize it. But I mentioned that she was an honorable mention in uh, Watch Mojo's video on top 10 uh, voiceover actresses and actors for anime dubs. So, there you have it. I had no idea. You look like you're having a lot of fun with this whole situation, Yamato. That's a real change of pace. Yes, detective work really plays well into those dark, stylized, chuny fantasies. Oh, come God. on. Hell no. What are you even talking about? Our next step, for those asking, is to head back to Radio Lakaikon. The door might have opened while we were searching. Or not. Or not! You can't just say it did when it didn't. You don't even know that for sure anyway. I don't know that for sure. Good lord, how long have I been playing this game? I've been recording videos all day today. You taking a safe break? Be careful you don't overwrite the wrong file. Must have opened. Did it open? It didn't open. Are you kidding me? Where's the door? And no doors here that I can see. I wonder where it'll be. You don't think Cannon kidnapped Katomi the way he kidnapped Moe, do you? Why? If we had, I think we would have heard at least one eyewitness account by now. Well, if nothing else, at least we did learn some new information. You mean about his white silk hat? And that he carries a cane. Last time I asked people about him, someone mentioned that he was really short. But in our questioning, people said that he was tall. And when you meet him, he'll guide you to a world of delusions sweeter than your wildest dreams. Or something like that. But none of us have even seen him yet. Despite reports of him wearing the outfit equivalent of a signal flare. Hmm. Which can only mean he must have made his way into a delusionscape somewhere. So we should leave the hunting to old boss and his compatriots. Oh, great. See, I can finish y'all's thoughts, too. Oh, my God. Here we go. You. Yeah, me. <laughs> you kids just don't know when to say when, do you? I told y'all before to stay out of our way. But I don't think we ever agreed. Thanks for the advice, though. <laughs> it ain't advice. It's a warning. Now listen and listen well. Smashing the delusions in Akiba and capturing Pinky both fall under our purview. Whatever. You say our, but by the looks of it, you're all alone today. Unlike you, we ain't got the luxury of time. We've been splitting up to cover more ground to find us the deluser. So you're looking for Kotomi too then? Oh ho! Didn't realize you'd already pinpointed her. Credit where credit's due, that's pretty impressive. You'll be even more impressed when we find her first. I promise you that. Big talk for a little girl. Oh. But you ain't gonna get a leg up on us freedom fighters, no matter how you try. Oh, we'll see about that. There's always a way in video games that we can always... We can always prove that. We can prove that. We can prove you wrong, Mr. Smartass. Hey, where the hell's Mizuki? Asahi? Hey, that's right. You do know my second in command, don't you? Just tell me, where is Mizuki right now? <laughs> I guess there's no hurt in telling you, but you gotta tell me something first. <sighs> if you meet up with Mizuki, what are you two gonna talk about? Well, I. Uh... Stupid question, I guess. Should have known. Well, so be it. If you wanna talk to Mizuki, you'll find him on Junk Street. Got it. Hey, Tachibana. You good? Sorry, guys, but I have to go. Hey, wait! Guess I'll be hitting the trail myself. Got more ground to cover, after all. Just a moment, please. What's up? You looking to throw in the towel? Why did you tell Asahi where he could find Mizuki? There's some kind of misunderstanding between them. And let's just say it wasn't for Asahi's sake that I told him. 
What? What? What does he mean by that? What does he mean by that? Jeez! You can't just let off- You can't just end the scene like that and say it's okay! What the hell does he mean by that?! What the hell does he mean by that? I can't get over it. I can't get over it! What the frick does he mean by that?! What the hell, man? Mizuki, Asahi? What do you want? You need me for something? No, I don't need you for something. I want to know why you joined up with a shady group like the Freedom Fighters. Shady, huh? I don't think it's any of your business whom I spend my time with. Uh. Or would you rather have me tell you every private detail of my life before I do anything? Oh, you sick- No, that's not it at all! Is that all, then? Are we done here? Uh... Certainly didn't take you long to make new friends. Sounds like they're waiting on you. What a dick. I don't care if they're waiting. I'm talking to you right now. What a dick. I have nothing to talk about. Well, I do. Lots. And I have nothing to say. Got it? Come on, Mizuki. We were never going to be able to keep up with each other the way we were. And you know it. What? So consider this my goodbye and good luck. What a f Come on! We didn't even get to talk about anything. Why? New friends, huh? What's wrong with them? Yeah? Hello? Hey, Asahi. Sorry. I know you're busy. Not anymore. What do you need? Well, um, we just figured out where to find Cannon. You mean it? We found a witness at Akihabara Station. But like last time, they said he disappeared into thin air. So in other words... Yeah, he's got to be hiding out inside the audio delusion. Saki and Yamato have already gone in to investigate. Just thought I'd let you know. Wow. Okay. Sorry about all this. I'm headed your way now. Don't go anywhere. I hope those two don't do anything stupid till I get there. Does it even really matter why I joined the Freedom Fighters? I can't go back now. Well, you shouldn't even be talking to him like that, you douchebag. You sound like a total a-hole. You, you agree with me, right, editor? He sounds like a total scumbag at this point. And to think I actually liked his personality at the beginning of the game. Now I just hate him. Now I just hate him. I mean, I like the Freedom Fighters, but I just hate him. Why are they the audio delusion out of all things? I thought I got rid of that. Asahi, you made it. Sorry to keep you waiting. You said Saki and Yamato were... Yep, they're already inside. Gotcha. Come on, we better head in and lend them a hand. Um, but... Are you okay to fight? I mean, what about... your friend? It's fine, I'm fine. Right now, we just need to focus on catching up with Saki and Yamato. Okay. We're no longer friends at this point. I mean, don't go into such a freaking melancholy over such stupid things. If he's not your friend, then he's not your friend. He's a mortal enemy, and you have to deal with him. A save point. Shall we take a break? No, we shall not take a break, even though I want to. But this looks to be one tough customer. What should we Back attack my ass? Well, one hit KO. One hit KO. Oh, oh. K uh, uh. It's a customer. Please do ensure you're all presentable. It's a customer. Please do ensure you're all presentable. It's a door. Shall we enter it? It's a customer. Please do ensure you're all presentable. There they are. There they are. Hey, Saki, Yamato. Huh? Well, looks like all that caterwauling's just Tachibana. 
Didn't expect him and Bunny Girl to catch up so quickly. Bunny Girl? What brings you here, Asahi? Is everything okay? Well, no, it's just... I heard you guys were in here, so... I... Sorry. I thought I'd tell him. Oh. I see what's going on here. I can see when I'm not wanted. It's not that, Dingus. Look, there's no need to worry about me. I'm fine. I wasn't able to find him. I'm sure our paths will cross sometime, though. I mean, he is the Freedom Fighter's second in command, after all. But for now, we've got bigger fish to fry. Cannon could be in here somewhere, right? We gotta go find him. We certainly do. Let's get to it. Why'd you have to lie to them? Saying you're not that he you didn't find him? I mean, I get it was a pointless conversation and nothing went forward with it except a scumbag! A customer has been spotted. Shall we engage? Maybe later. Not being a dick here, but not being measy for all I care, but seriously. Back attack! Hey, I got one experience point. Who would not want it? Come on. No, I'm not taking it safe. Oh, there's Akari. Why? Why are we fighting the Freedom Fires? Hold on. Look over there. It's... Cannon. There's nowhere left to run, so don't even try. Yamato? I don't think that's Cannon. Is that? It's Akari! What's going... Hmm? Yoo-hoo! I can't believe my eyes! Deary me, it's Asahi and his bosom buddies! Huh? Akari? Damn it! I can't believe you made me think that was canon! What are you doing in a place like this? This delusion's already been cleansed! Yeah, we know. We cleansed it. But that's not why we're here. You haven't seen canon anywhere, have you? Huh? Wait, Asahi, are you telling me that you and your friends are also looking for him? Unfortunately, this place is a dead end. Nobody here but little old me. Oh man, really? I can't think of anywhere else he'd be hiding though. Okay, I expect a boss battle, which is fun and all, but why does it have to be with some kind of heroic group at this point? Come on. Unless... Yeah, that's gotta be it. Hmm? Yamato, you figure something out? I sure did. Akari Hozuki. You are canon. Oh, frick. What? What? Have I been canon this whole time? Oh, uh, yeah. Maybe. <laughs> no. I never even suspected me. Wow. This is a real shocker. Still, what a great day this is for Super Freedom Fighter Akari. Come on. Yeah, I know she's into it. I know she's... She's being sarcastic, I know that. Uh, do you think we should jump in here? Sometimes it's best not to say anything at all. Come on, Cannon! Show us your true form! <laughs> now that I've been discovered, I suppose I have no choice! No matter how nefariously you disguise yourself, you'll never be able to trick these all-seeing eyes. Evil Chortle! Perceptive, young Yamato. Very perceptive. I'm afraid you're correct. Oh my god. She re Christina V really got into this, didn't she? All the actors and actresses, they all got into this game. They loved it. They loved it to death. <laughs> she must be having a lot of fun right now, Akari. Akari must be having a lot of fun. <laughs> and the music in the background proves it. Like, come on. What other music would you use? But I've no need to disguise myself any longer. For I, Hyper Freedom Fighter Akari, am indeed canon. Ha! I knew it from the moment I met you. Cringe. Hey, you two want to knock it off? Yes. Yes, I think they do. Ow! What the hell, Tachibana? <laughs> A falling out among allies, all within sight of an arch enemy. It's almost too painful to watch. You too, Akari. Owie! 
so nice that we can all hang out and have fun together like this. Akari, is it really true that you haven't seen Cannon here? <laughs> yep, truer than true. If I'd seen him and didn't capture him, Boss would have gotten real mad at me. But someone saw Cannon disappear nearby. Could he have gotten out of here before we even showed up? Or maybe he was never here in the first place. Oh, you... Wait, you're telling me she isn't... <laughs> Ouch! You've lost your speaking privileges. It doesn't seem like you're going to find anything else in here. Let's exit back out and regroup. Oh, I'll come with you. I'm hungry as a horse who could eat a horse. <laughs> Fine by me. Back to Akiba together. Yay! Uh, Asahi, she's part of the Freedom Fighters, remember? Yeah, and? And you have no idea what she's up to. I mean, yeah, but come on, this is Akari we're talking about. I think she'll be fine, don't you? I think I'll be fine too. See? Even she's willing to let bygones be bygones, at least for a little while. Yeah. Say bye and consider them gone. For a while. Really, Sahi? Really? I mean, she's going to follow us out either way, right? Okay. He has lost all... All... He has lost grips to humanity at this point. He has lost it. Like... Look at her. You know that something's gonna be up. Bingo, bingo! Give this man a cookie! I don't think she's gonna be a problem either, to be honest. I don't know. Ryu, don't take his side. I really Yay! don't. I get to leave the delusion with an entourage! Hooray! If you say so. I really don't trust her, but at the same time, I wish I really did. Maybe I do, and I just don't, I, I just don't want to think that I don't trust her, or whatever that is. Please, just... I think I do trust her, and at the point where, uh... I, d I really don't want to think that I didn't. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I'm back! She really did follow us all the way back out, huh? <sighs> Fine, whatever. Hey, Akari, are you and your fellow Freedom Fighters also trying to find Cannon right now? Yes, indeedy. Can you tell us anything about him? No way! Even if our clues are really tiny, Boss would get really mad if I told you a single one. I don't even want to think about what he'd do if I told you he was blonde and fair-skinned. What? It's even a secret that he's really short and shrimpy. What? Short, blonde, and fair-skinned. Thank you, Akari. That should be quite helpful. What? what, what? How do you know all that? <laughs> Thanks, Akari. What? Oh, no. Did I just spill the beans? Ooh, boss isn't gonna like this. Oh. Hey. Why is it that the only piece of inconsistent info we've got is Cannon's height? <laughs> yeah, some people said he's tall, other people said he's short. It's kind of weird. I wonder if it's because of the silk hat. If you include it in his height, then he's tall. Otherwise, he's short. He really is like one of those urban legends where you hear different things in different neighborhoods. Guess that's how rumors usually work. Only so many of them have any real meat on their bones. Yep. Email from boss. Woohoo! We're gonna have Odin at today's party. Oh, score. Well, just be careful on your way back, okay? You bet. And I'll be sure to tell boss how much fun I had with you guys. Bye bye. That one. All right. You two get along far too well. Don't forget, she's a freedom fighter. Yeah, I know. It's just having her around's kind of fun in a weird way. It's like I'm babysitting or something. It real, it's ironically just like that, honest to God. And I remember at the beginning where she said she remembered him or something. I don't know, maybe that was the other girl. You know, the blue girl. Oh. Okay, yes, I can see that. And I suppose we did manage to glean some new information from her. So I'd say today was more win than loss. You seem to be ignoring the fact that our big lead on Cannon just fizzled. What do we do now? We haven't made much progress in finding Katomi, either. Both are mysteries we'll need to explore further, but we're not going to make any headway tonight. Let's call it a day. I like the sound of that. Good night, everyone! Well, at least he doesn't even sound like a need at this point! Yeah, you heard me! This point! Electric Town area.
too much fun, 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 too much fun. Returning home. I already knew. I already know. But come on. Asahi's pad, which is still on the side of the road. I never got over that. Never will. Honey stain. I'm home. What? Ugh. Huh? This is sick. Who's calling me? Hey. Oh, hi, Yamato. What's up? Well, it's just. There's something I keep forgetting to say to you. Hmm? I'm kind of okay that my delusion's been nullified. I'm actually sort of grateful that you helped me get rid of my dark history. So, thanks. Hey, wait, you're not... Man, he actually hung up on me. Is he worried about the whole Mizuki thing? <laughs> I can't believe I've got a kid like him worried about an old coot like me. That's pretty lame. You're only a few Why, ages Mizuki? apart. At least tell me why. We always used to do everything together, but now I just wanted to keep you out of this whole mess. I don't know. Hey, what you doing? Huh? You. Yeah, you. Me? That's what I said. You by yourself? Yeah. Then let's play together. Huh? Being by yourself is boring. <laughs> Who are you? Asahi Tachibana. Asahi, like the morning sun, shining down on all the flowers standing tall. Tachibana. I'm Mizuki Aihara. Mizuki, huh? Well, you're gonna be my friend from now on. Huh? Why? It's in our names. Mine's got sun in it, and yours, well, Mizuki has the moon, right? <laughs> it does. Weirdly does. It weirdly does. Ah. <sighs> Midnight. No daytime. Freck. Hi, Asahi. Good morning. Mm, good morning. Someone, quick, take a picture. Asahi Tachibana's on time for once. <sighs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why the long face? Are you okay? I dreamt about my past last night. There's still no sign of a delusionscape entrance near Radiola Kaikon. Thanks for looking into it anyway. But where are we supposed to look for Katomi and Cannon now? Why don't we check out some of the other delusions? We could be hiding out in one of them. Already tried it. No sign of Katomi or Cannon in any of them. Well, that sucks. <laughs> I'm officially out of ideas. Which leaves us with only one option. Legwork, legwork, legwork. Those clues won't find themselves. But maybe someone will find them for us. Why don't we check back in with you-know-who? Who? You know, that violent Eden information seller. She's gotta have some new dirt for us by now, right? Oh, you mean Akemi. Is Akemi's place even open this early? Mm. Besides, she hasn't sent us any emails. Couldn't hurt to swing by, at least. Never know where a lead might turn up. Yamato, are... are you getting into this investigation? No, of course not. This is my usual level of unenthused disinterest. Hmm. Oh, I see what's going on here. Shady bars, information dealers. You like all these back alley shenanigans, don't you? I like you shutting up. <laughs> he does have a point, though. There's no harm in stopping by for a visit. And Akemi is a very accommodating host. <laughs> Alright, enough kink shaming. Even though I don't know what that means. Ugh, just thinking about it. Junk Street. And this one. Side Streets.
Well, I never heard that before. Hold on. Hold on. I want to do something. Just real quick, alright? No. No, 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 no. Okay, let me try something.